You never forget that feeling of anticipation ahead of college graduation, but the job market for soon-to-be grads has drastically changed since the pandemic. WBZ's Paul Burton explains why it's actually helping them to find work. Oh, I'm crazy excited to get out into the real world. Stonehill College senior Daniel Vasquez knows his future looks bright, and as graduation quickly approaches, the hunt for a job is on every senior's mind, including marketing major Emily Demanchek. That would be so exciting. Uh, it would just be such a weight lift off my shoulders. Her dream is to have a sports marketing career. She spends hours on the computer applying for entry level positions. It's definitely something that takes a lot of time and a lot of research. Great time to be a senior, yes. Wow. Andrew Leahy is the director of Career Development Center at Stonehill. He says this year's graduating class spent much of their college career under COVID, but now the job market is opening up. The National Association of Colleges and Employers put out a report that hiring is going to increase over 30 percent from the, for the class of 22 from the class of 21. Vasquez, who's interned at Merck and the New Bedford Public School System, says he's on his second round of interviews for two positions in HR and recruiting. The big thing I'm seeing is a lot of hybrid opportunities, a lot of remote opportunities that I wouldn't have had two years ago. I think the job market's finally starting to like get better and get back into that place before COVID. Director Leahy says the landscape for opportunities looks extremely promising for seniors graduating in 2022, but there's a lot of steps seniors need to take in order to prepare to nail that first-time job, which the Career Development Center prepares them for. So let's switch this up. Leahy says a lot of recruiting is going virtual, so coaching students on how to represent themselves with energy through a camera is also critical. Coaching students on to be, to be lifelong learners um, and how to tap into those competencies and employ them in a number of different ways is going to prepare them for all of those different changes they'll see down the road. Once I get, I'll get a, a sense of assurance, but at the moment it's, it's a little bit stressful. Definitely doing something with sports or brand marketing or advertising. In Easton, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.